is the new Rhea backpack from Coach worth it or not? Let's go have a look in store. Hello everyone, welcome back to another mommy review where I review all things for love of. Today I'm checking out Coach, in particular the Rhea backpack and doing a handbag review on this new backpack that came out with Coach. Now before I get started, if you like the content on this channel, I appreciate it very much if you consider giving this video a thumbs up and consider subscribing to the channel. Thank you so much for considering and on with the video. So the new Rhea backpack just came out with Coach and they have come in two different sizes. This is the first one. This is the 21 inch size for the Rhea backpack in color block. This one in the chalk and the brass combo I think looks beautiful. You can see there's a C turn lock for a small pocket in the front. On the bottom, you're going to notice that there are no feet, which is one of the things I find is the most disappointing things for this handbag. There are straps on the back, of course, because it is a backpack and has a top handle that is reminiscent of like the row bag that has been really popular from Coach. But here for the backpack itself, you can see that it's pretty secure. So there's this uh, button closure on the front, snap closure, and it's a drawstring opening. So you can open up the bag a little bit by adjusting the drawstring. So it's pretty generous in terms of space and you can slip in that drawstring adjustment underneath and then snap it on and it just looks very clean that way. There are multiple colors that it comes in and I just want to show you how it looks like on the model. So this is the 21 size. It's priced at $480. And this is how it looks as a top handle, which I think looks really beautiful and really cute. Um, I think that if over time you get really tired in a day from using it as a top handle, you can easily switch it over to a backpack, which is super handy uh, as you might get tired over the course of the day. So here, going back to the store, you can see there is this other color version here i think the chalk is just really beautiful but as a mommy i'm really worried that the bag would get very um dirty quickly over time or show wear quickly over time uh, next i want to show you the larger version of this bag this is the ria backpack and the larger size is exactly the same design it's just larger it's 610 dollars here it is on the website itself can see like pretty much looks the same i think it looks so cute here in there in this photo it looks a little bit like a dumpling the handle is four and a quarter inch draw and then it has like these adjustable shoulder straps as well with the drawstring opening it's made of this like soft pebble leather glove tan leather very good sturdy material and here's how it looks like on the model itself i think it looks really cute as a backpack for the larger version and then here's how it looks like on the top handle. And I'll provide the dimensions below. It's nine and a quarter inch in length, 11 and a quarter inch in height, and five and a quarter inch in width. But I think out of the two, I personally prefer the larger one just because it's a little bit more spacious. They also have this one here. This one is actually the Rhea Backpack 21, but in a signature textile. And this one's priced at $520. Has this like brass cocoa burnish ombre. Has like the six signature textile. And then you notice that the handle drop is a little different from the, the larger size. So it's actually three and a quarter inch drop compared to the larger one. But the design is essentially the same. And also has adjustable shoulder strap. And the dimensions are here below nine inches in length, eight and a quarter inch inch in height and also four and a three quarter inch in width but looks so cute as a backpack right i'm just a little bit worried that the small 21 size might be just a little bit too small what do you guys think i think the backpack is just beautifully made it's like perfect size for it, like a backpack like purse the combination of the smooth leather and the pedal leather is also really nice i think that top handle is a nice touch and for sure, I feel like the snap closure on the flap appears to be very durable. With that said, I do find that the turn lock on the front pocket is a little bit hard to close when the pocket is like empty. 
Um, the interior of the bag is very roomy and the inside slip pocket is pretty deep. I would say that um, it fits a lot more than what you think it is. It feels really sturdy and very high quality. It's just too bad it doesn't have feet. I like how the drawstrings fit under the snap loop so it's not in the way when you're closing the bag. And apparently the longer strap is perfect for you to consider using as a crossbody if you're looking for added security, especially when you're in the city and you're worried about pickpocketing. And then the lock of the bag is just like a fantastic security measure. Like I've been waiting for Coach to release a backpack of the style, so I'm really excited it's finally here. The leather is quite thick, it feels nice, and the lining inside is nice and soft as well. So here at the website, you'll find that when you put in the RIA, there were six results that will come back and it consistently comes up with the two sizes, the 21 and the regular size for the RIA backpack. I would say the 21 personally, as you've seen in the store, feels a little bit smaller to me. Uh, so I think if you're interested in the smaller version, you should probably double check the measurements to ensure that it will hold everything that you need. But it is at a better price point at $480 here. So here is kind of like the brass um, yellow color. Um, so you can see that color on the website looks very different from what you see in store. The in store is a little bit lighter, which is why I do some of these videos because I know that you don't all have access to a coach boutique near you. So hopefully this will be a good comparison for you to see what's in store versus what you see online. Um, I would say the bag for the 21 is a little bit difficult to get in and out of despite it's like one large compartment that you can see from the drawstring design. Um, the flap actually latches into place pretty well, but you have to press the latch um, in the right place just to get it like close properly. So I find that a little bit difficult, uh, especially if you have long nails. But so far, I am pretty in love with this new backpack from Coach, uh, the Rhea backpack. I uh, would love to hear from you if you have any experience with this backpack yourself, if you love it or you think you will leave it for the future. Well, that's it for today. Thank you so much for joining me on another mommy review and I'll see you next time. Take care and stay safe everyone. Bye for now.